Let's get this one going. As they look to be starting with a bit of a BX sec. A good old simple, short, long, and a flash lined up by Stair. Is this going to be used to disrupt the swing? Oh, might be late. Oh, yeah, Stan's forced away by the util, but they don't clear the cubby. Oh, only the one. Stair keeps his Charles in the advantage. It's good work from Stair. 18 by M. We need to work out what we're calling him. ASL? ASL, exactly. 18, 18 young yeah. man. 18 year old young man. Mandarin. Mandarin. Mandarin out of the round as Captain Mo. He's got a clutch in him. 34 years young, Alex. 34 years yeah. young. A spring Age chicken. Age is nothing but a number, bro. Um, They're out middle. 29. 29 Just for 18 year old 18 year old male. <laughs> After effects onto Yabby. 18 year old male onto Stout. And Zhao Sage. With a frag. This is what we're talking about. This is what the slut boys can do. <laughs> you know, God damn it, you've lost it. Slut? It's <laughs> It's Steel helmet. Steel helmet, okay. But we always call them like Ast, don't we? That's, everyone says them that. Yeah, that always happens. That's probably with their recent form, but this is uh, a new constellation of the stars. Even with them alive, Chad. This is fantastic. Yeah, I they, reckon they did handle business. Didi's kind of giving him an AK there. He doubled down. He d oh. Respect. All hunting. Go, go, gadget arms. They are going to start leering in through main. Stare with the ability to take a few more away. And there you have it. Across the line. Happy to retake the lane late. That already shows a bit of poise. So the fact that they got away with that in the previous round might have Positive sign. Uh, last bullet in the dome onto Zal Sage. Stown with an opener. Now, with the bombs disconnected from all of the players right now, it's an interesting one. Kind of going to let Captain Mo work. It might be cleared. You can see Stown coming back. Yeah, there it is. So, four man mid clear, two through the donut, two through red. Wolf Force, Steel Helmet in towards the B finish. 18 YM in cave. Oh, but the bomb spotted down towards the doors. Gets awkward now, doesn't it? Bro. Just on to DD. Gets away, finds an upgrade. Everyone's got themselves an AK or an AWP, so that's pretty damn good for a CT side. There we have it. As the third round comes through, so uh, short lived success from uh, Steel Helmet. Yeah, that yeah. is what I thought was going to happen. Okay. Oh, nice catch there from 18YM. Yabby. Yeah, Quick to take his place though, just keeping cave fight going, bro. That looked like a nice shot from on, onto the head of Jansage. I think bro's a really good safe pair of hands to have in this team. In Monty, he always had some of these roles where he was left to his own devices. And that's going to be a clear. Unable to get the bomb down, just AE and was just AE, four to one, three round the difference. And this should be a map where Astralis just absolutely put things in. It's just gonna be- I, The so protocols are so good. It's like, well, floor of flame mid, floor of flame lane. And that's the thing when we see like on the fly flashes being lined up from Steel Helmet, it doesn't fill you with much confidence to try and punish. Like a little harass. Setting Yabby up. Beautiful flash. A team kill in the mix, Captain Mo. We'll be regretting that one as yeah, it looks like all five should be staying alive. Not going to be fun for Didi. He's actually moving away from the bomb. If we knew that Monty wasn't coming earlier, which we didn't, Steel Helmet replacing Monty, who were unable to get all five of their players situated. And that's one of the keys of playing Counter Strike, Alex. You do need five to play. There's the swing, there's the round, six to one, five the difference, and Astralis on debut with Device as the in-game leader, Rugger as the coach. A great way for them to save money in this round is to not buy helmets, because you know they've all got AKs. It's a great way. That's at least a few hundred bucks. Oh! Oh. 
that's the collateral. Yabby and Didi down. Device with the Darth and Lee Dig. Double and triple. And now Stair's going to steal away his ace. Just like that. Yeah. How cruel. How mean. Quad kill from Device. There's the Tech Nines. They try and run him down. They try and overwhelm the orb. I'm sure that's always going to feel good when you get to, uh, well, get 12 and 1. Had to be done. Sometimes it just has to be done. Mm, oh, the AWP Deagle combination. Satisfactory. It is the most satisfying. They call it the uh, Smoke Snake Strap. Smoke Snake Strap. A steel Helmet Special. Yeah. Well, DD's got um, a little bit of a look on A. Stair might get caught off guard by this. He will. DD manufactures an opener. Oh, he's across as well. The line of fire. Device will punish him. Puts. 45 damage down range. Captain Mo. God, that's terrifying, they isn't have to it? Clear this. Yeah, they will. Of course. How horrible for Captain Mo there. Now we've got 80 18YM. <laughs> Just call him 18 year old male. I think that worked better. <laughs> I agree. For the 29 year old. Yeah, the 29 year old, 18 year old male. Xiao Sage and of course. Adobe After Effects. Oh, they're going to plant the bomb. He's gone and done it. 18-year-old male gets a frag onto Yavi. It's a 3v3. They're very low HP, though. 18-year-old male. Post up with the AWP. Needs another one here. Oh, he's let it go. Stout shuts him down. <laughs> Now, Sage down, and it does seem like an eighth is coming. After effects, maybe. There's something here for AE. Spams away. Connecting bullets. They're off the bomb. Oh, he's just running away. He's had enough. He. What? Oh, nice try there. <laughs> Cave smoked off. Down on the spam. And they're going to try and punish by lurking through. Oh, a lot of damage there. Surely you're coming through. Oh, that's so naughty. They're thinking about How it. How's he gotten away with that? Yeah, he actually does get caught out by DD's timing. A 4v4. They can still recover this half. Four rounds up for grabs. Make a T side out of this yet. Oh, that's a good well placed HE grenade, and it's going to be a big one for Zhao Sage to let go, bro. Just standing and not able to deliver the double. Step just takes his place. For them, it must feel like there's just constant stream of defenders. There's everywhere you go, there's someone to take that's his nice. place. That's a big frag from AE. And a missed shot from the AWP of Device gives him a second chance. Running around over peeking. They're going to double swing. The one, two, three. And they'll leave with nine. Okay, well, as expected, Astralis are running away with things. You, uh, you haven't got anything particularly well drilled. You've got your smoke sailing through. But the region as a whole, right, if we're going to talk about it, the region as a whole is, you know, only has two names that have any real worth to it, and that's Lin Vision as well as the Mongols. Yeah. That's a shot. That's a nice double. Device, however, is just having a field day. And you talked about it, Chad. Sometimes he'll just go for the AK. And it's cost him his life, pushing forward, getting a little bit uh, a little cheeky with it there. Well, Bro's going to cut off the rotation point. So he's going to head through the doors down towards T-Spawn. And so Bro is going to get the first contact. And oh, there's the glance. Now he's under a whole lot of pressure. Smokes himself off. Throws out a nade. Not going to connect for any damage. This is looking good for a steel helmet second. Mm -hmm. Here goes Stair. Likely he clears Captain Mo here. Oh, but he did. And now a 1v1 emerges. Can Captain Mo come up clutch? Bro goes down. Clean headshot from Captain Mo. And a second round on the board for steel helmet. Captain Mo rolling back the years. That's himself on the board. Full lane control essentially for Stan right now. They just need to clear out towards this beehive position. There's a flash over. White screen. But DD's about to be caught in the side. Well cleared from Stan. Aware of all of the possibilities. Now Sarge gives up his position outside the doors. Devices AWP for two. It's a 2v5. 
Nice shots. Captain Moe's warming into things. Go on. Take down device. One bullet will do it. Can't control. And it's a 10 to half. They're having a lot of fun. Astralis, that is. Steel Helmet. They're close to being a knock to the lower bracket. Oh my god, what's he called? Oh it looks god. like a bee rush. He's, He's called a yeah, just look at the util. Bee. He's done the cheeky smoke, the big one, the, the cool one. Okay. And all, oh, they're going to win. They've already killed everyone. 100% success rate for device T round calls. He has won 100% of his T round calls. What so are, this has to be one of the most remarkable things I've ever seen in Counter Strike. Oh, did you see what he did there? Two smokes. And a molly. And a kill. And a, and a kill. And he's got 20 kills, Chad. Unbelievable. They say IGLs can't frag. Well, wait until device arrives. 20 bloody frags, Chad. I think he's having fun. I, th I think so, too. He wasn't having fun no, at the RMR. now he's having some fun. He's like, having fun. He's, I'm seeing smiles. Yeah. I'm seeing giggles. I mean, it's probably quite easy to be smiling and giggling when you turn two up, make it 11. Oh, come on now, Alex. I'm sorry, this there is I professional am. Counter yeah, you're right. <clears throat> Video games aren't enjoyable. Yeah, just keeping them hyped up. A lot of early space. What about You've this used those. 18 smoke? year old male flank, though. Oh, you're right. <laughs> Gotta watch out for those. And Xiao Saga's about to get cleared. Yeah, it's just no hope for him there. And there we go. That's the 18 year old male dig we know. All right, they're into the B bomb site. And they have the bomb. And they have 12. So still devised with 100% success rate. Right, Chad, yeah, there is a 100% conversion rate in his T side calling so far. Well, let's let everybody know what else they have coming their way today, shall we? Go on. Coming up next, they have uh, Harry and Hugo. Ooh, I love those guys. Or Prince Harry and Lord Hugo, I think, is their official titles. Right. Uh, they'll be covering off a bit of action. G2 taking on Liquid in a best of three. Well, that could be intriguing. Furia versus Mouse. Also a best of three. And uh, on the B stream, you will have 9Z versus Heroic for elimination and Lin Vision versus Tai Lu. As everybody from Astralis goes down, a glue and an AK are saved, but the smiles still on the faces. It could very well be it. And they go and start with a fight into AE. He's managed to find a one undone. Lovely timing. Captain Mo gets a double. Gets away with his life. Here we go. Well, the B bomb site is completely open, and Stown is starting to investigate. Bro's bringing the bomb that way. The rotation back. They've just dotted in time. Stown probably surprised to see nobody home. 2v4 to keep the sheet clean. Oh no, they've lined up. He knows where they both are, and just down finds the equalizing double. Miraculous calling here from Device. Yeah. Oh, sick call. What a sick call. He said, go kill long, get to plant for long. And walking through the smoke, it's Captain Mo lost. He's up to DD. What's he got for us today? D in his name, and a D in the game. It's 13 to 2. The crowd erupts. Astralis on debut with Device as the in-game leader. Rugger as the coach. It's a miraculous T-side. Three straight rounds, 100% from Tom Cruise. Mission ah. impossible, they said. That oh, smile that. on the dial, it says it all. The crowd now, proud now.